Hey guys, I did an interview with Chip Lynn, executive producer, Dino Charge. Everybody keeps asking me about Go Busters. Okay, so Go Busters, um, personally I watch Go Busters, the whole thing, and I love Go Busters. I mean, I love the theme, I love the I love the spies, I love the, the hangers, I love the zords in the hangers. To me that makes it, kind of grounds it in, in reality. Whereas, you know, the option, of course, is what we do now, which is where we call on a Zord and it comes out of a mountain, right? So I kind of like I kind of like changing it up like that. But the decision about which Japanese season to go with is made over my head. They asked for my creative input, but in the end, it turned it's it's all about metrics that I'm not even aware of. Have they discussed uh, possible future seasons at all? I know that they're discussing it, but I don't know how how far those discussions have gone, and I don't know which one they're going to decide on. I know everybody's kind of wondering, and. Uh, I, I honestly I don't know yet. I love ninjas. Um, it's, it's a very strong theme, ninjas, right? Because you can kind of do anything with it. You can kind of get into the area of magic and call that ninja. And that there's, there's a lot of possibilities there. Um, but at the same time, I really love the police force of Go-Busters. Now, would they back up that far? I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, to me, um, Trains is not like a real strong theme in the U.S., but but the stuff they did was really good. It's it's kind of sad because I'm comparing everything to Core Uger, which was you know done by Koichi Sakamoto, which you know he's so talented and it turned out to be so good. And it was a fantastic first experience for me to be able to control the whole season with such great footage. But after this, honestly, I would prefer it be you know um, maybe Ninjas or even Go Busters. It might have been somebody I was talking to at Bandai who was telling me that Go Busters probably has a four to five year shelf life. So they were saying that they could come back to it, but then you know after so many years. Things like the monster suits will start to deteriorate, so they won't be able to use a lot of the stuff that normally gets sent over from Japan, making it not a usable season anymore. Yeah, honestly, I don't. It's it's true that the the um, the suits, the monster suits, only last so long, um, and that's the consideration because they're they're not inexpensive to make. I really don't know which one. You know, if they could even go back that far, you might be right. So, you know, if it turns out if it turned out that it was either trains or ninjas. What can I say? I'm a ninja guy. The short answer to everyone's question is, of course, they don't know yet. If it was up to Chip, looks like he's leaning more towards Ninja. And for 2017, I would say Go Busters is still a possibility, and nobody knows what's going on yet. That's the answer for now. I think this video is just going to be answering that question. I have more Chip Lynn interview footage coming. I've got Bandai stuff, Ranger interview, and some other Comic-Con stuff, and probably a vlog on our other channel coming soon. All right, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. I'll be back soon with many more good videos, and good night.